Okay, that was a Monday. So I don't have to look at the calendar for 8,000 likes to find out whether it is a Monday. And once this is done, let me show you where we started from. Next one minute is going to show you something very, very crucial. Same engine of pivot table. Same engine. And it's telling me that look, for the different dates that have worked upon. <coughs> let me just go back one step. Uh, I missed one step, so I'm just going to clean this up. Data, next to column, and uh, next, next. One of the available things to clean this data is DMY. Yeah, just give me a minute. So I'll also give you a resource from where by all you can learn this data for free, all these tricks for free. These are available on my portal. The all free videos, you can watch them. As of now, just populating the pivot table. And I would want you to leave uh, this discussion with an insight which we are now going to see. Now watch, close it. All the eight and a half thousand lines of date, which I'm going to group as, uh, let's say, months and years, this is single year data. Now, okay, getting closer to my final answer. And how about this? We are now seeing a data which says Jan May. Total power to you, <coughs> Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So you may not look at those 20 lakh lines of data, but the inference, the kind of amount of information that it draws out from the last 10 lines will give you an indicator of what things are actually happening in the background. Just taking a minute more before I conclude this. So it tells me that, okay, June have, uh, July has been the month of the highest consumption, hands down. And uh, maybe Sunday is one of the days when I'm seeing some consumption. Had it been a factor which is closed on Saturday, Sunday, this would have raised the flag. And if I wanted to know, please give me details, I'll just double click on the Sunday. All the transactions that are happening on Sunday is now before me. So that's in, in all folks, friends. This is what I want to discuss. Now, our first step may not be a coding, coding or programming, programming because that prohibits our learning. You know, we get discouraged. We can start with something as easy as path over and use the existing capability of Excel, combine them to start with dynamics. So I will share my portal where you find all, all, all uh, three videos on this. I'll, I'll just open up that particular line. And uh, in case you want to mention or uh, note this portal down, yodalearning.com. Yoda, in fact, uh, for the benefit of Ronald members, in fact, I used to get requests from Ronald members across the country that, sir, can you also make uh, videos in Hindi? So there's a portal which has recently launched, no login required, no payment required, fee of cost. It's called excelsuperstar.org. <coughs> you must visit the second one because recently uploaded a, a video, free video, on how to remove password from a protected worksheet. The client has given to you an uh, Excel file which has some cells protected. You can, without any software, remove the password just using Notepad. So visit Excel Superstar. That's all from my side. Thank you all for listening. Thank you. Thank you.